Now, with these examples, the other value you'll see me use sometimes, and you saw that your book gave you two calculations, essentially, for the range. Uh, I prefer to distinguish these by calling this the range and the real range the additional one. The real range is the one where you take max minus min and add one to account for the real limits on data. And so I refer to this as the real range. And so for this data, the real range would be five minus one plus one, five. And again, I, I note that it's the real range because if you think about how many numbers do we actually span there, one, two, three, four, five, we actually span five values and the real range accounts for that.